It's another year to remember the day Boko Haram insurgents ransacked Chiba community in Bonu State, located in Nigeria's northeast, disrupting the lives of 276 girls in the process. <laughs> The wave of emotions emitted by distraught parents was felt not just in Nigeria, but across the world. A movement was created in their support to pressure the federal government to secure the release of the abducted. And every day since the night of April 14, 2014, the noise over the girls has not reduced. The demand of release played a substantial part in making the federal government double its effort to ensure that a large number of the girls were released. During the year, it was my great pleasure to secure release of 103 Chibo school girls. We are doing our best quietly and as effectively as possible to get the rest released. However, as encouraging as this reunion of parents and once lost daughters is, the reminder that somewhere out there, over a hundred victims are yet to be free from the clutches of men who forcefully claim them leaves a sour taste in the minds of families, wondering if the federal government can live up to its pledge and bring back the girls. Oralu Ashonibare, Channels Television News. <laughs> <laughs>